Tech Power welcomes you to a new video and in today's clip I'm going to show you how you can remove pre-installed apps on your Android TV with ease. Let's get right into it. So anyone who owns an Android TV knows this user interface and as with any Android TV you have a lot of apps which are not being used simply because you do not need them and sometimes they might even be a bother. However, it is impossible to uninstall the apps using normal means as they are system apps. However, there is a solution. You can use a launcher and the launcher is a program where you can rearrange your surface. However, all the pre-installed apps will stay as they are. Does not matter if you use them or not. There is another solution for that if you want to delete certain system applications. Before we start though, we have to switch to our settings. In settings, there is an important option called device settings, which you will need. Select the option and open up the info tab. Scroll down to the point called build and click as many times as needed on the OK button to activate developer mode. Congrats, now you are in developer mode. Switch back to device settings and a new option called the developer options appears in our menu. Click on it and scroll down until you find the option called USB debugging and allow it. Scroll down until you find the option called wireless transfer. This is important. Activate the option and for now we have to switch to our PC as we need to download the following program. In Google just type in ADB App Control. This app is usually meant for smartphones. However, it works the same for any Android TV or just any device which has Android in it. We visit their website and after you click on it, scroll down to their provided download resource and just simply get their zip folder. After you downloaded the zip folder, extract the zip file and install the app. After it finished downloading and you are done with everything, just open up ADB. This is how the app looks like and now we can clearly see the message which says connect your Android device. That means we have to connect our device with the ADB program and for that we need the IP of our Android TV. Back on the TV we have to find our IP address. Just simply open up the TV settings and in those settings find the option called Network and Internet. Select the option and click the OK button on our Use Network. Now you can see the IP address and we have to put the address into ADB. When you switch to ADB, on the top right corner, write the IP address. In our case, it is 192.168.0.2. As soon as you are done, just click on connect, which is right next to it. The TV will display a message and all you have to do is accept it. ADB is going to ask us if we want to install AC Bridge and basically what this app does or this extension, it will display app icons and original names instead of package names. It is not necessary, but makes your life easier when using ADB. This extension takes a little bit to install, however, we can already see all the installed apps of our Android TV. In a few seconds, everything is ready and you can see the original names and the app logos as well. Let's say we want to uninstall AccuWeather. I don't need this app at all and all you're going to do is just click on it and on the bottom right, select the option called Uninstall. After a few seconds, if you confirm this, a message will appear 
and confirm this message. Another message will appear and ADB will ask you about the backup. Deny that. And now you can see that the app disappeared. You can do that with all applications which you don't need. However, be careful to not delete any app which is essential for Android or your device is probably not going to work how it is supposed to. Let's take another example, another app to uninstall. And this time I am going to choose Kodi. Since I do not need the app, just repeat the same steps as before. Select uninstall and confirm the action. After a few seconds, confirm the pop-up message to delete the app. And that's it, the app is deleted. Sadly, ADB right now is for Android devices only. What is nice though, is that you can see the device name, how many installed apps it manages, and also deactivate any application you want. This is a guide to clean up your Android device from un unneeded apps, which are usually impossible to uninstall. Should you have any more questions, just use the comment section. And if you like this guide, simply subscribe to our channel and click on the notification bell to receive infos about our newest guides. See ya!